Hello everyone, my name is Mikey B and this is a quick video just explaining the key features and information that has been released regarding the upcoming Hannibal at the Gates campaign DLC for Total War Rome 2. I hope this video is helpful to you in some way so let's get on with it. The first major piece of information is that there are three brand new playable factions available and they'll also be available in the grand campaign mode. The factions are the Arvaki, the Lusitania and Syracuse and just a bit of brief information about these factions the Avaki are a Celtiberian people who basically inhabited the central and northern territories of Hispania or modern-day Spain if you will uh, the Lusitanians are an Indo-European people meaning that they were originally nomads their culture basically is heavily influenced by the Celtic tribes that surrounded them and they occupied the western Iberian Peninsula or parts of modern day northern Portugal and then the colony city state of Syracuse which is found in the southeastern side of Sicily was founded by Greek settlers from the regions of Corinth and Tenia in 1730s BC so because of the city's Greek heritage the city-state became very wealthy and powerful in terms of money and technology and culture Along with the new factions, there are 12 new units being introduced to the game spread across the new factions. The Avaki has access to painted warriors which are melee units and they also have access to Celtiberian cavalry which are also a melee unit. The Lusitanians get access to stealth spear infantry called the Lusitani guerrillas which can be used to ambush enemies. They also get access to Lusitani spearmen which are probably their standard melee infantry. Now Syracuse only has one new unit compared to the other factions and these are the picked hoplites. Um, they are a specialist unit of elite hoplites and apparently Athens also gets access to them so you can use them in the campaign for Athens if you so choose to. The Romans also have access to new auxiliary units and these are the auxiliary scutarii which are Iberian infantry uh, melee based and they also have access to auxiliary scutarii cavalry which are again heavy Iberian melee cavalry. On top of all this there is also a brand new set of mercenary units which are the Etruscan hoplites which are basically Italian spearmen trained via the traditional Greek hoplite way. There are also Samnite warriors who are heavy infantry and there are companion cavalry which are heavy cavalry noble horsemen. The Hannibal at the Gates DLC will also include other features such as the 12 turns per year cycle with seasons of the year transitioning with special gameplay effects corresponding to the seasons. It also features a two player multiplayer co-op campaign just like the core game except this is a more compact version of the Gram campaign obviously and it makes for a quicker co-op multiplayer experience. Carthage and Rome also have access to brand new diplomacy focused technology which we'll be able to have a look at when the game comes out. The DLC also adds brand new historical battles such as the Battle of Cannae and the Battle of Zama. Both were pivotal battles in the Second Punic War. So in conclusion, I'm really looking forward to this campaign DLC as I didn't actually get the Caesar in Gaul one. This is more my preference when it comes to history. And if you're considering purchasing this DLC, I would probably suggest you check out my first impressions video on release day before purchasing because the DLC is pretty expensive. But being that it's a Total War game, the hours of gameplay you could possibly get out of it will probably be well worth it. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe. More videos regarding this DLC are on the way and you might enjoy some of my other recent videos. I cover the majority of strategy games and PC games in general and if you found this helpful it would be really appreciated if you could leave a like rating on the video and thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day.